All right, so this is like the third video for the day. That's all the stuff from the truck box that was back here. And I've been, I've been at it. Uh, saw blades just weren't happening on this. They were bending and breaking. I think I broke a blade off in my saw. But there's half of the, one half of the truck box that was back there. There's the other part of it. And that is cleaned up. For the most part, we got some smalls, but that big old truck box is out of the way. It's a blessing. It's a blessing to have it this far. I wanted to be wanted to have I, I'm get the plan that I had to, for the day is actually coming together so so I'm gonna do it now I'm gonna get this lot, the truck box loaded up. Get this loaded up. Hopefully, I got room for the shelf and the filing cabinet. I'm not sure. Keep doing what I'm doing. See where I go. See where I get. other truck boxes I think there's like like three or four more on the other side I was gonna cut them up today too but I ran out of saw blades and actually I only bought that pack it was only a five pack bought them because I was cutting I was cutting up the copper pipe I got that where I want that grab this other piece and bring it over here just kind of scoop things along This is the heavier of the pieces.
a little closer to that one. Oh, that's fine. I got probably another hour and a half sitting here. Huh? How's it going? It's going good. This is the truck box. Oh, Jesus Christ. That was, yeah. Uh, that was back there. <sighs> yeah. Oh, that's the stuff that was in it. I want to thank you again for cleaning that plastic out of there. You made it so much easier for me. Thank you. I said a lot of the scrap, uh, scrap aside, too, so. Yeah. You did a hell of a job back there for me. I appreciate that. Because yeah. if you didn't do that, I wouldn't be where I'm at right now today. I'd be still monkeying around. You're just here alone today, aren't you? Yeah. So, I usually work alone. Every now and then I'll have somebody help me. Mondays. Monday yeah, Mondays I have some Mike with me. Yep. Yeah. And then I keep trying to work these other guys, but. They just don't want to. It just, yeah, it's one of those things. This would have been gravy for them. They could sit on their booty, just put stuff in a barrel. Pretty much. They'd have loved it today, but no. <laughs> Getting her done though. That's a lot of empty space. Actually, you know what? What in God's green earth? That had way too much momentum. All right. Oh, just like that. Yeah. Oh, I'm sorry. You all right? Yeah. You know, it was, I was like, what's going on? But that's okay. Thank you. Oh, you want to try to lift that? Try. Yeah, it's it's got stupid weight to it. <laughs> yeah. Perfect. Right. Thank you again. I missed the gopher, so I mean. Hey. At least you're out here trying. A lot of people out here that don't even want to try. 
So are you from around here? Uh, across the river. Oh, okay. I literally no joke about that. We just go down straight. Really? <laughs> That's awesome. Man, it sure is nice to see that box gone. Maybe it's this time. Oh, yeah. All right, take care, man. That kid's cool. Nice young man. They got that young man, they hired him to uh, fill up the, the other dumpster, the garbage dumpster. They got trash around the building. Yeah, I probably got at least one more day here. This is two. Oh, that's metal. Well, this will probably be my only load that I get out of here today, more than likely. Let's see what time it is when I get down at the scrap yard. So this stuff right here, a lot of this stuff came from um, inside the... Stuff came out of that box that I just loaded. Once I'm done loading this up, if you're just not tuning into this body shop job, um, I will. I'm gonna do a walk around and explain what we were doing here and what we've done. But if you've been following along, you see a lot of stuff has been done. 
A lot of work went into this. metal. But I'm just going to keep loading stuff until I have absolutely no more room. Working up with sweat now. It was nice and chilly this morning. You get that barrel out again for these smalls. That's way more plastic. At this point, it's just easier to fill up this barrel. They're calling for a significant amount of snow. I think Friday. I mean, it's Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, it's going to snow. I gotta really.
get some of this stuff. So yesterday was election day, I'm sure it was for all of you guys too. Uh, was, we had a couple of them and a, the one that I was really looking forward to seeing this morning was the was the governor or yeah the governor of Michigan see if we're gonna keep our keep the governor that we have or did we get a new one? I uh, woke up late this morning and uh, didn't even get a chance to watch the news. So I wanted to get hit in this, this car, but. Blueberries and stuff all over it. <laughs> See, that's something I'm coming with the snips. Snip that out of there. spots
Oh man, I came in handy. Um, let me see. I'll grab this just in case I need to. Smalls over here. Problem is, is he's buying it. They grow so much over this stuff. You can't get it. Ah, man. I'm not going to continue to waste time, so I'm going to ask. Hey, could you find out if you guys got a way to cut these vines down? Possibly? Yeah, they're, that are all grown over the... I'm trying to get that shelf against the building, but it's probably 50 years of vines. I can't even... I was trying to pull them. I can't even pull them. All right, appreciate it. I also got to get that door, too. Man, I'm determined to get this side of this place cleaned up. A couple barrels still. Yeah. There's still quite a bit, I guess. Well, if you can... I 
don't even know where this line starts and where it ends. Vines are growing up through this. I'm not trying to make more of a mess with somebody else, but. Put it in a pile for them at least. This is what's frustrating. Trying to do something you can't because you're being hindered. Overgrown vines. Just everything just so overgrown back here. What do they say? Out of sight, out of mind. That's kind of what this thing is. I can get in there easier. This vine right here, I don't know if you can see it, this vine right here goes all the way over there. I mean, it's crazy. Some vines, man. No? Okay. Yeah. Okay. I'll muscle it out of here somehow. Um, no, I think I'll be all right. Thank you, though. Actually, I got a, I, you know what I just thought of? I, I got a couple knives. I didn't even think about it until just now. Appreciate it. I didn't even think about it. Get my knife out. Let's cut these. Yeah. 
not thinking. At least just cut him enough where I can uh, get that thing out of there. Ooh, I thought that was going to slide off the other side like it did. Like the other thing did. There's that. There she is. Sharp knife. Do 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 do. Better. It's pretty young, you know. Cut the vines just to get out. Set my knife over here. Hopefully, I don't forget. Oh, yeah, that's it. 
heavy load right here. See if I can drag this out of here. Holding it up. Dying right there. See, you can't get them on because of these vines. See, this is why this job takes forever. Because of this kind of stuff right here. I think it's starting to rain. Like, literally, I have to pull some raindrops. It is starting to rain. Oh, that's just lovely. Starting to rain. That's all I needed for it to start raining on me. It's getting dull already. It's not a knife for cutting it. vines. Whatever. Not how I want to do it, but raining, man.
It wasn't supposed to rain today. It wasn't supposed to do anything. That's just lovely. Pretty good. Doubt it. I stuck to it.
this thing to roll. Yep. Nice. I might have to stop because it's starting to rain pretty good. I'm only thinking that because I still have to I still have to unload all this. Sucks that it's raining. coming down pretty good. Gosh, I'll dang it. <sighs> yeah, I'm done. I, I, I'm not gonna. It's starting to rain too hard. I'll grab my extension cords, get cleaned up. I saw. few pieces over here so I gotta get Aluminum too. Well, no matter what, I'm not gonna wrap this job up today. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'll probably be here for just a few. Probably, probably, probably. So I'm going to get back. 
I appreciate that. Eat, yeah, no, you're good. Thank you. The rain kind of let up just a little bit. I don't know. That's a good sign or, or what? Every time I say it's going to light up, it's not. Yeah, it's coming down now. It let up for a second. Yeah, it's time to go. I actually got a lot done today but even by myself so I'm actually pretty satisfied with how so today went Did I leave my driver's side window on? Yep. Sit down. I get my one off. It's pouring. It's raining more than I normally work in. Yeah, my seat's soaked. Whole arm rest. Everything. I'll kind of give you guys an idea when I'm out. Look at this. Can't work in this. One o'clock. Man. I still got quite a bit of a day to go. Alright guys, this is the end. Uh, I'm going to stop. I can't go no more. So I'm going to get things strapped down and uh, head over to Pad Nose and get this stuff unloaded. If it's still not raining, if it's pouring when I get there, I'm just going to have to uh, just gonna have to deal with it till the morning. So either I will see you here in a little bit at the scrapyard or I will see you tomorrow morning at the scrapyard. Either or. Hope all of you have a blessed day. This is Elite Scrap Metal Pickup out of Grand Rapids, Michigan. I appreciate all of you for viewing and following. I do really appreciate it. Have a blessed day, y'all.